Hello my brothers and sisters and welcome back to another reaction packed episode of Chris the Butcher and friends and tonight my brothers and sisters yeah I still haven't had a shave right I still haven't had time to do a proper recipe again the oven is still on the fritz I need a new fan or a new, a new oven Preferably, I'd like to get a new oven, but uh, that's at the minute, all right? So, oh yeah, what was that? Yeah, we're having one of these. Brothers and sisters, I give to you Chris the Butcher's Super Cool Review. Also, if you can see behind me there, Lou has made a Fuck off, big lasagna. So that's another reason why I'm not doing a recipe tonight, because Lou has already made tea. A big pan of burnt shit. Da-da! Courtesy of Lou. But what we're doing, we're having one of these here, right? We're having snack... We're having Snacksters Big Stack. As you can see there, it cost me £1.99. Uh, I've seen Snacksters before. I don't think I've ever reviewed a Snacksters. I'm sure it's been done a million times, but not by me, right? Snacksters Big Stack, a double sliced white bread bun containing two cooked seasoned beef and chicken burgers and a slice of processed cheese served with a sachet of burger sauce. Now, you've got, you've got to bear with me on this one. I could be here some fucking time. Wait, sesame seeds, wait, wait, wait. Mustard, mustard, milk, mustard, milk, 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 milk. Fuck me, it could be song that, couldn't it? Huh? A really shit one. Yes, yeah, so, uh, it's got, a, it's got the guarantee, the usual guarantee. There's nothing else I can tell you about. Apart from it's dated till the 7th of February. And that, my brothers and sisters, is currently two weeks. Another one with about a million fucking half-life on it. Eh? Drop this and you'd have to fucking go underground for a fucking hundred million fucking years. Right anyway, let's get down here, get out the wrapper and have a shove these at it. So there we have the big stack. And we have our plate for our burgers. So we're going to delve right into this. I, I ain't got the great mobility in my fingers. That's why I struggle with packaging and grip. You know what I mean? Fuck it out. Yeah, there's, no, there's no danger of that accidentally fucking opening, is there? Right, so we've got our burger sauce. We've got our shit processed cheese. Our empty wrapper, we've got our bun, we've got our burger, we've got our middle bun, we've got our burger. So it does say actually on the instructions on this, instructions, and they're, they're very posh. On the destructions, it actually says toast the bun. So that's what we're going to do. I've got four slots on my toast, I've got three bits of bun, so I'm going to do that. And the burger has to go in the microwave. For a minute and a half. So that's what we're gonna do as well. Wow. 
So, we're building it, aren't we, really? There's our two cremated fucking burgers. That's the bottom, so we're going to put a burger on the bottom. Uh, I don't want to be good. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. If I can, put half of the burger sauce on the bottom one. Yeah. I'm going to put the middle snotcher on. The burger. The rest of the burger sauce. And the thinnest, most see-through plastic cheese you have ever fucking seen in your life. It is absolutely fucking thin. To the point it won't peel off the fucking plastic proper. God, this, that is stingy. That has got to be the most fucking thinnest plastic cheese I've ever seen. You could fucking trace through it. Right. Bit stuck to my hand. <laughs> Chef delight. Like. Get a bit more burger sauce right there. Sorry for my big daft ons. Right. Brothers and sisters. There is our Snacksters Big Stack. Now let's get up here and slide it down my gizzard. Do you know what? It doesn't look too bad. It really doesn't. It doesn't smell brilliant. It just smells, it just smells a processed fucking shit, doesn't it? You know what I mean? Don't forget, it's got two weeks for me buying it today, live on the shelf, or in the fridge, should I say. And that is with a fucking bun as well. <sighs> anyway, let's get it down because of... That weren't bad. Would I buy that again, brothers and sisters? Hell no! If it were a pound, yes, I'd feed it to kids. Connor! <laughs> Actually, just wait there. Connor! Do you know what though? The burger sauce on there actually had a bit of taste to it. In fact, that was the only thing that had any fucking ta taste to it. Other than that, was it edible? Well, I've just ate it. I'll give it one of my kids. So yeah, it must be edible. Like I said, no, I won't buy it again. I didn't like it that much. But if you like this, press like. Comment, share it on your social media, and subscribe. And pray to lose Big Pan and burn shit. And become a family member of Hashtag Team CTB. Where I, you got it. I fucking love you. Well, I hope you don't expect me to eat that pan of shit over there.